You're watching the news on Bahrain International. I'm Hamid Shaban. Good evening. In line with the directives of the government's executive committee, chaired by His Royal Highness the Crown Prince, Deputy Supreme Commander, and First Deputy Prime Minister, Prince Salman bin Hamad Al Khalifa, Sustainable Energy Authority SEA President Dr. Abdul Hussein bin Ali Mirza has announced the issuance of the first renewable energy certificate issued by the SEA through a fully electronic system platform. The renewable energy certificates represent a historic shift in taking advantage of renewable energy in the kingdom. The issuance of the first renewable energy certificate as part of the launch of an initial pilot phase through which the program's flexibility and application mechanisms are studied at the national level to include all renewable energy systems to be registered in the Renewable Energy Certification Program in stages. This will be carried out through the application of blockchain solutions to ensure transparency and the possibility to track and verify every certificate issued to each system registered in the program to ward off the risks of electronic breaches. The Electronic Platform Program for the Management of Renewable Energy Certificates has been designed in a way that allows producers to directly record the productivity of renewable energy systems they own on the platform so that SEA can verify the amount of energy produced and approve in the form of a renewable energy certificate. A renewable energy certificate is issued electronically through the program for every one megawatt hour produced and approved by the SEA. The system also enables producers of renewable energy to offer renewable energy certificates issued electronically for sale to those wishing to invest in renewable energy and benefit from certificates to overcome the challenges that prevent them from producing renewable energy themselves. The renewable energy certificate system will provide an opportunity for investors and financing institutions to evaluate investment opportunities, finance sustainable energy projects and verify the energy output which is produced through reliable and approved programs and tools. The director of the Marine Directorate at the Ministry of Works, Municipalities, Affairs and Urban Planning, Khalid Shirawi, said that fishing has been banned during the season in which fish reproduction as per international standards and practice in order to preserve marine life and food security. As Shirawi affirmed that there is keen or that there are, there are keen follow-ups on the matter by the ministry in line with the national strategy to maintain food security. He said that the effort is being carried out in cooperation with the relevant parties to raise awareness among fishermen and added that the bureau in charge of monitoring fishing activities will be made more robust. The Ministry of Health said today that the number of active coronavirus cases reached 4,161, with 379 re new recoveries and 389 registered new cases. The Ministry of Health urges everyone to adhere to the rules and affirm the importance of following instructions such as washing one's hands with soap and water on a regular basis, wearing a face mask along with avoiding shaking hands and close contact. This while covering the nose and mouth when sneezing and avoiding public spaces when possible.